Next at 10, the ultimate surprise for a Madison area Marine. Officials helped reunite Sergeant Ross Gunlock with a longtime friend, one he served with in Afghanistan. This was a reunion a year and a half in the making. It felt very good. It felt very good. Wisconsin Marine Sergeant Ross Gunlock and his yellow lab Casey sniffed out bombs together in Afghanistan. As any bomb dog handler knows anywhere, you combat or not in combat, all that matters is that you don't miss anything. And she didn't. The two would separate when Ross moved home to Arlington. Casey hired by the Iowa Fire Marshal's office. I promised her if we made it out alive, I'd, I'd do whatever it took to find her. Today, Ross thought he was at the Des Moines State House for testimony, but was surprised instead. First time I talked to him on the phone, I go, hey, look, if I can pull this off, are you willing to drive to Iowa to get your dog? And he said, look, I would swim to Japan to get my dog. At the ceremony, Reynolds would retire Casey and turn her over to Ross, but needed help replacing the lab. Ray Reynolds called me up and he said, hey, look, I need some money and I need it quick. In three days, Iowa's Elks Association raised the necessary $8,500 to get the fire marshal a new dog and give two old friends the chance to start anew. I owe her, you know. I owe her. It's like I want to take care of her, but I owe her. So I'll just try to give her the best life she can have from here on out. What a neat story. And Casey's replacement, a bomb dog named Vega, is already hard at work in Iowa. While Ross and Casey will return to Wisconsin Saturday, and News 3 will be there for their homecoming. You can see their story tomorrow at 10 o'clock.